Yep, they're all still axes and all still use up the same durability. We're doing that, yep. And then moving on, we've got the fruit crook, which I don't know how to determine the fruits for any of these. I don't think it details that for every type of tree. Uh, I think that's it. Now that's all it says, so I assume we just use this on leaves and then just see what happens. So we've got some apples there. It's got 100 durability, so it doesn't have much. So I don't know if this also means that you're know, just potentially able to get apples from these or something, because these are jungle leaves, if I'm correct. So, no right clicking action, just left. Okay. We'll go to... So not getting, like, cocoa beans or anything from the leaves. That's something. Uh... Yeah, yeah. You know, we'll just try summoning it. Oop, that'll do. So what do we get here? We get... Some cloudberries from spruce. So that's interesting. Quite a bit of them. So we can find out what those do soon. Uh, mushrooms there. Oh yeah, this was the one that had the mushroom bio next to the jungle. Conveniently. Guess I'll present the seed for anyone who's interested in that. Um, otherwise we've got the crook. And we'll get uh, some other saplings, and we'll test those. Just to see what we get with each one. So we want birch. Jungle, we've tested acacia, and we we'll want that as well. Dark oak. So we'll do this one first, which oak gives us apples. No surprise there. We'll go with birch next, which get rid of these apples real quick. Gives us nothing so far. Maybe it just doesn't drop anything. Possible it doesn't. Yep, so nothing there. Got a keisha. Yep, which gives something maybe, I just can't reach, uh, conveniently enough, uh, that'll do. So let's see what we get here, we get just saplings basically, yep, so nothing there either. Oh no, we get plums, sorry, plums from that, I guess, let's try again. Yep, so plums from acacia. Nothing from birch. So I get up here if we can. So let's try again with birch and nothing at all. But with acacia we get plums. So that's good to know. I mean they're cheap to make as well, so you can easily get a ton out of these. Yep, so plums. And what else do we have? Dark oak last, which I don't know if I have the space. I actually also need the double as well, so that's the thing we consider. Yeah, we'll see if it can generate. I have absolutely no idea if it has the space, but it's probably possible. Okay, and this one has a chance of giving us what? Pears. So I don't know if the birch is supposed to give us pineapple and it's just not generating anything, or jungle possibly is supposed to give us pineapple but we're not getting it. I don't know. That you find pineapples another way, so and I'm just unaware of what you need to find them. Uh or peanuts even for that matter. I'm not sure where you find those. Maybe in a village or something, I assume. So yeah, we'll just try and consume these real quick. So we'll go effect, we'll go give, and we'll go hunger, and we'll try and avoid mobs that attack us if possible. It is night time, so we'll just do this. So, oh we are on peaceful anyway, so that's clearly going to benefit, because I forgot I changed that. Okay, so if you happen to come across some peanuts, you can consume them and they'll give you one and a half there. If you want peanut butter chocolate, which is peanuts and then obviously cocoa beans and so on there, we'll get two and a half. With a pineapple, if you happen to come across one, you'll get two. 
Cloudberries will give us one. Obviously, there's quite a bit there. Plums will give us two. And pears will give us one and a half. And finally, we have the foraging enchantment, which I assume when you apply to an axe gives maybe a bit more benefits. So, we'll just apply this real quick. So, just do a blackstone one. What have we got here? Ready of fruits. Bad to say about the enchantment. Does not. Is there anything in images I can find? Uh, let's see, there's a lumberyard structure that's rare apparently as well, there's miscellaneous items. And we also have yet to cover the sawmill as well. So that's what the lumberyard structure will look like. We'll see if we can actually generate that as well after we do this. So I don't know if this means it gives like a crook, or it gives like, perhaps no other thing here as as I can find. No, okay, so nothing there. I wish I had an enchantment-related um, detailing mod, but I don't currently have that on me. I'll have to check that off-camera, and I'll put something in the comments if need be. Um, so check the sawmill real quick, and then we'll get to the structure. So the sawmill, I assume, just gives us the ability to put our logs in here to get planks, and it's an auto-converter, so that's useful. Do we have the ability to use a hopper underneath? Get that real quick, and get rid of the mycelium. This just removes the logs. Ah, it does planks afterwards, so you might need pipes and maybe or maybe not filtering to send these out, which I don't think I have any currently on me. I don't. Uh, actually, I've got a transmitter and receptor, so I can use those real quick from Megacraft and see if that works. Um, just to test something. Put this here, it's just what they're converting for us. So we'll just do this and this, and we'll just get a chest. That's the energy ones, isn't it? Yep, I want a uh, item version of those. I want, real quick. And that, okay, so this, and this, and this, and then I'll get a wrench. So we'll just test these and make a craft ones here. And that has sent both of them. Okay, I can filter with this. So I'm going to want that one, I think. Something like that. It's going to send it anyways. Uh, let's see. Blacklist. That's what I want. So I go logs. Again. Let's see what happens. That's just going to keep sending them all. Oh wait, no, it's just converting them because it's sending a ton of planks here, that's why. That was my own step there. So that's just sending a ton of them. Or... no, okay, so it is. It's just eventually it takes a while for it to do it. That or it, uh... I'm just missing something. It's just doing it every so often, but it takes a while to eventually display in the chest what's happening. I was like, hang on, that's just converting a lot and it's wasting it, but it is sending it, in fact. It's just, it takes a bit to go between them. But there we go. So that is possible if you want to use pipes, but not a hopper, because that'll... Uh, actually, technically you can filter with hoppers, it's just... The general use of a hopper, you can't, but with filtering it, you probably can. Um, and that's it, besides the structure, correct? So we'll go to that so I don't forget. Does anything show... Up, it seems not. So nothing visible there, so you just have to sort of look for it, I guess. I have no idea if it maybe does appear in a savannah, or it's just that it happens to be really rare and just generates anywhere. I have no idea. We'll just check a savannah anyways, because that's what they screenshotted it. We'll take a look. And I'm expecting not, but you know. Just check anyway. And it is rare, so it's not the easiest thing to find. That's why I don't usually search for structures unless there's a locate structure thing, because you never know. 
where they're going to generate. It's difficult to find. So, no luck here. My guess is it's just a thing you'll just come across every so often, but it isn't the most easiest to find. And I have no clue on the foraging one, so I might just add to, uh, say, some like enchantment descriptions if possible. And I'll do that off camera and then. Well, sorry. Reload the game, I mean, and then uh, we can find out. So, one second while I do that. Okay, so add enchantment descriptions, and nothing displays there, especially for some other modded ones as well, it seems. So, yeah, no luck there. My guess is maybe it's useful for fruits, or for maybe some other type of things to do with logs. But, uh, yeah, I got no clue. I don't know if it's maybe like using the uh, features of the crook and then using it on leaves, but on axis or some other type of benefit, but there's nothing else detailed as far as I can tell. So, we're just gonna have to go with it. Obviously, I have to ask the creator, but uh, that's about all I can go off of. Thanks so much for watching, and goodbye.